And hey, well, this is Francisco from OneSure Doctor Phone. And if you're switching between phones or if you just want to keep a backup of your WhatsApp messages, then this is the video for you. And today I'm going to be showing you how to back up your WhatsApp messages on iPhone, but there's also going to be a version for Android users too. So do keep an eye out for that. Now let's begin. And so one of the most secure methods of doing this is going to be through our own Dr. Phone software. So make sure that you download it first from the link in the description if you haven't already. And then once you've downloaded it, just go ahead and launch it. And then go ahead and click on WhatsApp transfer from the main menu. And then from here, I just go ahead and connect your iPhone to your computer. And it's going to detect your iPhone immediately as Dr. Phone tends to do. And from the left panel, just go ahead and select WhatsApp option. And this is going to present numerous features right on here. And then go ahead and click on backup WhatsApp messages in order to proceed from here. And the backup process is initiated automatically. So you simply wait a little while and leave your device connected to avoid any kind of connection issues. And once the backup is finally completed, you will be notified. And to see your backup, just go ahead and click on the view button. And once that's complete, you're pretty much good to go from there. And trust that your messages are actually secured on your computer without worrying about it any further. You can also back up your WhatsApp messages directly from WhatsApp itself, which is usually a pretty simple process as well. And now this is going to use iCloud in order to back up your data. And so do make sure that you have access to it. Here are the steps for starting the backup. So first off, just go ahead and launch WhatsApp, then click on settings, chat settings, and then chat backup. And in some versions, you do have to go into settings and then backup. And go ahead and tap on the backup now button. And then from here, and you can also schedule the backup frequently as well if you really wanted to back this up more than just once. And this will take the backup of your WhatsApp chats to iCloud directly. And to restore WhatsApp chats, I just go ahead and launch WhatsApp on the target device. And to recover the chats, you have to go ahead and set up a WhatsApp account all over again. And if you are already using WhatsApp, then uninstall it and download it again. So that that way, it's just a lot easier to be able to, to set it up once more and you should have your backup available there. And during the setup, it's going to ask you to provide your phone number for verification. And the WhatsApp is going to automatically provide an option to restore the previous backup. And then just go ahead and tap on restore chat history or the restore backup option. And just wait for a little while as your phone could restore at the backup. I just make sure that it is connected to iCloud with a stable connection and that is linked into the same iCloud account and that you had your backup sent to. And that's your guarantee that you don't only get to back up your WhatsApp messages, but that you also have a simple way of recovering them once you're finally ready to get them back. And so we're going to be returning to the computer this time, and we will be backing up our messages using iTunes instead. To perform iPhone WhatsApp backup, launch an updated version of iTunes on your computer and then go ahead and connect your iPhone to it. And from the devices section, go ahead and select your iPhone and go to its summary tab. Under the backups option, go ahead and click on backup now button and make sure that you have selected this computer to backup data on the local system instead of iCloud. It is going to be important to know that this is going to be full system backup, not only for your WhatsApp messages, but for your entire phone. So you will be waiting for quite some time as a result. Uh, but this is still a very effective and reliable way of backing up your WhatsApp messages as well as anything else on your phone if you need it. Our next method is going to be the simplest one for sure, and since this is essentially just saving a transcript of your conversations and sending them back to yourself in email format. And you won't be able to download them back onto your WhatsApp, uh, but you will keep the record of the messages uh, that you decide to email to yourself with this method. So this is how that's done. So firstly, just go ahead and launch WhatsApp on your iPhone and then select the chat that you wish to save. And swipe left to view its options and tap on more and then select email chat. In some versions, it is going to be listed as email conversions as well. You will be asked whether you wish to attach media or not in this backup. And then just go ahead and tap on the desired option here. And in this case, we're going to say to not include any media. And in the end, just specify the email ID, preferably yours, and then send that to yourself. Now you should have a permanent transcript of any given conversation saved onto your inbox, even though you won't be able to get them back onto your WhatsApp. And that's it. Those have been four methods of backing up your WhatsApp messages on iOS. So do make sure to leave us a like if you liked it, comment your questions down below if you need any help, and also do make sure to subscribe for more content just like this one moving forward. Now, until next time, enjoy.